this is an issue I noticed this as I was dumping my tanks from our last camping trip I've got a soot build up from my hot water heater so let's open this up and give it a look see if I can talk about this in between traffic out here so I removed this screw here this one here and this one here and I loosened this screw here. This here is the adjustment for the air inlet. This here is the orifice where the gas comes out of. Shoots in here and then this is the burner of course. Uh, loosened this just to slide it up. Removed this out. Dumped out the little critter that I'll show you here in a minute. There's his buddy still sitting there. He was parked up here inside the tube just a little ways and that fixed the problem got it all taken apart cleaned it out wasn't a spider it was just one of these daggone stink bugs that we have problems here with this year they've been chewing on our tomatoes ruining our tomatoes this year well this one decided he was gonna get in there and keep warm in my hot water heater and that didn't work Got him cleaned out, burning nice and blue now. Everything should be fine. If you, if you turn your water heater on, gas, and come out here and look, the flame should be, <clears throat> should be as blue as possible. If it's yellow, which was what I had when this bug was in there, you're going to get that soot all over the all over the side. It's not going to burn efficiently. You're not going to get good hot water. It's going to burn a lot more gas. All that good stuff. Now, I am not a professional gas man. I'm not a professional camper fixer-upper guy. I'm just a guy that does stuff at home. If you don't feel comfortable doing this, don't do it. But realize that if you see that black smoke, or if you see the black soot forming on the outside like I'll show you here something's wrong with your water heater get it checked out or do what I did and and look into it yourself I highly recommend turning the gas off before you start working on it and be very careful don't take apart anything that you don't feel comfortable about putting it back together and having it work properly. Just go ahead and get it checked out by somebody that knows what they're doing. Take care and have a nice day.